Because <laughs> the reason I say Matthew might be interesting is because I think you're someone who has, over the years, decluttered your life somewhere, haven't yes, you? Yes, sir. Yeah. Mm. yeah. So you, if you, have you got any clutter left that you could pass his way? <clears throat> Every Monday on Twitter, we just want to declutter. So we, we just have a, a raffle. Mm. The, the, yeah, we had a house upstate New York, and you can look at my resume and see, I bet you bought the house here, and I bet you sold it here, because there was a lot of really poor choices made. <laughs> In terms of films. Yeah, and, yeah, because I was paying for a house. I, yeah. was, I was paying for a lifestyle. But what's amazing is, because I know you've had, like everyone in, in cinema, certainly, you've had a career where I had, as you said, it's a roller coaster. But yeah. some of the parts you've turned down, yeah. it's very striking that you turned down some <laughs> yeah. of the biggest movies of the 80s yeah. and early 90s. Yeah. Can we say which ones you turned down? Sure. You were offered the part of Maverick in Top Gun? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, because I, I, I grew up with the war, watching the Vietnam War on television, and then my, my oldest brothers and my sister participated in the war. There's nothing sexy or romantic about war. Mm. So the idea of making a movie like Top Gun that would, that would m make it look fun and... and uh, Glamorize it. Yeah, I just didn't want to want to participate in that kind of storytelling. And I understand that, and I 100% respect that. I wasn't sure, why did you turn down Back to the Future, though? You were offered the Marty McFly one <laughs> yeah. in Back to the Future. Yeah, but when you think about, I mean, uh, Michael J. Fox, they, y you see why I turned it down. Well, because he was, but did you know he was in Next in Line? No. Uh, so then, in that case, yeah, no. the argument doesn't really work. <laughs> they had hired Eric Stoltz to play yeah. the part. Eric Stoltz uh, was let go, and they told me I had 24 hours to make a decision. And I said, well, Spielberg's producing it, but it's this guy Zemeckis. I've never heard of Zemeckis, yeah. but he, he, I didn't know that Zemeckis was as talented as he is. Um, but yeah, I just didn't, I, didn't, I didn't see myself in the role. But here's another role yeah. that Matthew turned down. He turned down, he, had, he was offered the Tom Hanks role in Big. Yeah, that was really oh. stupid. <laughs> Josh. Yeah. I imagine, already I can see you're a versatile young man. Yes. Have you done the acting? Oh, well, I told my agent I would be interested in acting, and then he got me some auditions for heterosexual men. <laughs> and I was like, I said I could do a bit of acting. I didn't say I was fucking Meryl Street. <laughs> do you know what I mean? <laughs> like, relax. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, <laughs> so, 